Okay, homesteaders. Welcome back. It's been four days giving you another potato tower update. And today we have a special guest. Yes, I'm not filming today. The queen of the homestead is here. She's filming. Queen, would you like to say something to the our two subscribers? No. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. But anyways, so as y'all remember the last time, it is time to add more soil to our potato tower. So we have our straw, we have our saw, we have some fertilizer, and I'm actually going to do the step-by-step -step tutorial with you today because I'm not filming and actually doing it by myself. So it's going to be live. So we'll start taking the straw as usual and building up the sides. And you don't have to be stingy. And if you don't have straw, remember you can use leaves, grass clippings, whatever you can get your hands on. I use straw, of course, because of the chickens. All right, so once you have that first level of soil, start scooping your soil mixture. On an upcoming video, I will show you how I mix my soil. As you know, I do a lot of clearance shopping at Lowe's, and I recommend you to do the same. So you simply take your soil, and you'll add it around the stem of the plants. I try to keep them separated as well. And it takes a good bit of soil to actually get this to compact in real good. So don't be stingy with your soil. If you have questions about this potato tower, feel free to leave comments in the comment section. If you have questions about any of the videos that you have watched with the Homestead Negro so far, either myself or the Queen will get back with you. So continue to add your soil. like you can go up another step which we can with this so we're going to go ahead and add in another layer of straw around the edges and remember this potato towel will not be complete until we have reached the top and once we've reached the top I'm going to show you guys something special that you can do to keep the towel cool in the summer months because it'll be a while before this is actually ready to harvest Queen do you have any questions for our fans today no the Queen is quiet today y'all she's normally not this quiet I don't know why she's acting shy for her first time making it on, on camera Before we go too far, take your banana peels, spread it out. Bananas give you a good source of calcium, good source of phosphorus. All of these are very important for potato development. And this year, I've been using banana peels heavy in our compost maker because it adds a whole lot of benefits to the soil.
all right so as you can see we are almost to the top and like I said once we reach the top we're going to show you something special if you think you have an idea of what we're going to do once we reach the top feel free to leave a comment I may do a little giveaway might mail you something straight from the homestead there's no telling what it may be we have a lot of surprises around here so this is the max we don't want to go no higher we have some nice weather coming up so probably by Sunday these may be above the top and once it gets above the top we can go ahead and finish this off and let it do its thing for the next couple of months so this is your potato tower update homestead Negro signing off you guys stay tuned, more to come.